This is Chicago's very own WGN Evening News at 4. Let's begin this Friday afternoon with some breaking news. There you see it. Police were close by when officers saw a man shoot another man inside a car. We're going to take you there live. Good afternoon to you. I'm Lourdes Stuarte. And I'm Ben Bradley. Thanks for joining us. One officer shot at the gunman who ran from the scene. Uh, WGN's Brona Tumulty is live in the North Austin neighborhood with the very latest. Brona. Good evening, guys. Yeah, the street just opened here a few moments ago, so we've had to move over a little bit, but I'm standing on Laramie Avenue, and this seems to be somewhat of a right place, right time kind of story. We're told earlier this afternoon, police were in the area. They happened to spot one man firing at another who was in a vehicle at the time. We're told officers jumped out, and at least one of them fired a gun, as many as three shots, in defense of the man in a four-door black Dodge Ram pickup. The suspect fled on foot while police rendered aid. The victim is described as a 27 year old black male. He was taken to Stroger in critical condition. Police are still trying to track down witnesses and hoping that some folks here in the neighborhood have private cameras that can help show exactly what happened. At this time, we have our incident response team and uh, detectives from Area 5 still on the scene. The offender fled westbound on Lemoyne and is still at large. Now, because at least now, because at least one officer fired a gun, those two officers that were here will be placed on routine 30-day administrative leave, we're told, and COPA is obviously investigating. Again, no arrests, no arrests yet. That suspect did flee the scene. If you do have any information on the case, please want to hear from you. You can also submit tips anonymously through cpdtip.com. We're in North Austin, Brona Tumulty, WGN News. Thank you so much, Brona. A story that